Let's answer question again from random post at ito ay post ni Sir Ronnie Rentuza Tubat. The question is, what is the smallest positive number that will give a remainder of 3 when it is divided by 4, 5, 10? All you have to do is find the least common multifold nitong tatlo na 4, 5, 10. We have a separate video on how to find the least common multiple. Ilalagay ko na lang sa description ng video ito. Now, in finding the least common multiple nitong tatlo, don't ka mag-focus sa pinakamalaki. Ang 10 ang pinakamalaki. Ang 10, ma-divide ba sa 5? Yes. Ma-divide ba sa 4? Hindi. Next sa multiple of 10 ay 20. Ang 20 makadivide sa 4 nitong tatlo. So, ang 20, yan yung least common multiple natin. 20 plus 3, kasi yung 3, yan yung remainder. 20 plus 3, and that is 23. So, ang sagot dito, what is the smallest positive number that will give a remainder of 3 when it is divided by 4, 5, 10, and the answer is 23. Isa-isahin natin. 23 divided by 4, and this is 5, 20, tapos 3. Remainder na siya na 3. Tapos next, 23, uh, 23 divided by 5, and this is 4, 20. So, remainder ulit siya ng 3. 23 divided by 10, and that is 2. 2 times 10, that is 20. So, 23 minus 20, and that is 3. So, ang remainder niya na 3 pa din. Therefore, ang sagot na 23 ay tama. Now, to double check whether naintindihan niyo ako or hindi, I'm giving you another three problems na kahalintulad nito. I-solve niyo muna. Ito yon. One, question one, two, three. Pwede niyo yung i-post muna kung you need more time to solve this one. But I'm giving you 15 seconds only. Ngayon, question number one. Anong sagot nyo dito? What is the smallest positive number that will give you a remainder of 2 when it is divided by 5, 6, 15? First, we have to identify kung ano ang least common multiple nitong 5, 6, 15. In finding the least common multiple, Tingnan natin yung pinakamalaking number. Si 15, makapang divide, maka, ma-divide ba siya ni 6? Hindi. Kapag hindi, doon ka sa next sa 15, which is yung multiple ng 15. Next ay 30, ang next sa 15. Ang 30, ma-divide ba ni 6? Yes. At obviously, ma-divide din siya ni 5. So, itong 30 plus 2, yung remainder ba? Plus 2, and that is 32. So, ang sagot dito sa number 1 ay 32. Double check natin. 32 divided by 5. Itong 5 na yan. This is 6. 6 times 5 equals 30. 32 minus 30, that is 2. Remainder niya ay 2. Next. 32 divided by 6. So, 32 divided by 6, this is 5. 5 times 6, it is 30. 32 minus 30, that is 2. So, remainder niya 2 pa rin. Next, 32 divided by 15. Itong 15 na to, pangatlong number. This is 2. 2 times 15 equals 30. 32 minus 30, that is 2. So, remainder niya ay 2. Therefore, ang sagot na 32 ay tama. After these exercises, or itong video ito, you may write down sa comment section kung nakuha mo bang i-perfect itong exercises natin na 1, 2, 3. 
Next, sa question number two, anong sagot nyo dito? What is the smallest positive number that will give you, uh, that will give a remainder of one when it is divided by two, three, four? Again, erase muna natin, hanapin natin yung least common multiple. Least common multiple ng two, three, four. In finding the least common multiple, doon katitingin sa pinakamalaking number nila. Four. Ang four, ma-divide ba ni three? Hindi. Doon ka sa next uh, multiple ni four, ang next sa four ay eight. Four times four, uh, four plus four ba? Tapos eight plus four, ganyan. Multiple of four, eight. Ang eight, ma-divide ba ni three? Hindi. So doon ka sa next, sa multiple of four. Anong next sa eight? 12. Ang 12, ma-divide na ni 3 at ma-divide din ni 2. So, ang LCM ay 12 plus itong 1 that is thir 1 that is 13. Erase muna natin. Klaruhin lang natin, ha? 12 plus 1 equals 13. So, ang sagot dito ay 13. Pero, i-double check muna natin. 13 divided by 2. This is 6. 6 times 2 equals 12. 13 minus 2 equals 1. Si 1, yan yung remainder. Next, 13 divided by 3. Itong 3. This is 4. 4 times 3 equals 12. 13 minus 12 equals 1. So, remainder ulit. Next, 13 divided by 4. Obviously, this is 3. 3 times 4, that is 12. 13 minus 12, that is 1. Remainder ulit ng 1. So, ang sagot na 13 ay tama. Ngayon, dito na tayo sa number 3. Kung sakaling hindi yun nyo nakuha yung number 1, I hope nakuha nyo yung number 2. Ngayon, dito tayo sa number 3. What is the smallest possible number that will give a remainder of 5 when it is divided by 6, 7, 21. Again, hanapin natin si least common multiple. 6, 7, 21. Titingnan ulit natin ang pinakamalaking number which is 21. Si 21, ma-divide ba ning na sa 7? Yes. Pero ma-divide kaya si 21 sa 6? Hindi. Kaya, doon tayo sa multiple of 21 yung next. 42. Si 42, ma-divide ba ni 7? Yes. Si 42, ma-divide ba ni 6? Yes. Kung yes lahat, obviously naman, si 42, ma-divide ni 21 kasi multiple nga siya ni 21. So, itong 42 plus yung remainder na 5, that is 47. So, ang sagot dito ay 47. I-double check natin. 47 divided by 6. This is 7. 7 times 6 equals 42. 47 minus 42 and that is 5. So, 5 ang remainder. Another one, see 47. I-divide natin kay 7. This is 6. 6 times 7 equals 42 ulit. 47 minus 42 and that is 5. Remainder ulit siya. May remainder ulit siyang 5. Next. 47. I-divide natin ni 21. Ang sagot dyan ay 2. 2 times 21 that is 42. 47 minus 42. Obviously that is 5. So, lahat may remainder na 5 kung ang sagot natin ay 47. So, therefore, ang 47 na sagot ay tama.